So DeepSeek cannot directly generate out Microsoft Word document, but if you want to generate Microsoft Word document with formattings and all, you can actually use utilize this trick. So I'm just going to go around and say, generate a Microsoft uh, Word uh, document on the content uh, of an article, uh, 10 best fruits with nutri nutritional uh, values and their benefits and colors of the fruits right here. Let's say for example, so I'm just going to go around and say, make the article attractive by using different font colors and font sizes, um, sizes and document formattings as necessary. So now, uh, as DeepSeek does not directly uh, go ahead and generate out a Word document, I'm just going to go ahead and write in this prompt. So I'm just going to say, generate out a visual basic uh, code uh, that I can run as a module in Microsoft Word for this right here, just like this. So if I were to go ahead and type this in and hit the send button, then what happens is that it'll utilize this. So this is the main keyword right here. Generate out a visual basic code that I can run as a module in Microsoft Word. So once you go ahead and do that, DeepSeek will actually process and will then will generate out a code for me accordingly. And now you can see that the code is being generated right here. So it says below is a visual basic application code that you can use to generate the Microsoft Word document. So you need to go ahead and wait for this to actually finish right here. So you can see that it is defining the font sizes, the font color, and everything right here with the content as well. So you can see that it is listing out the fruit one, the fruit two, and so forth. So uh, that's the fruit three. So I'm just going to go around and skip to the part where all of this code is finished generating. So the code has finished generating as you can see right here and it has started providing me steps as well. So now I'm simply going to copy out this code and then come back to the Word document that I have right here and I'm going to go ahead to the developers tab. If you don't have the developers tab enabled, then all you need to do is right click on the ribbon of Word document and then go to customize the ribbon right here, just like this. And then over here, uh, you can uh, find the developer disabled so you can enable it and press OK until you get this tab. So now if I were to go ahead and click on Visual Basic, this is what you have right here. So now you can go ahead on to insert and choose module and then let's say for example paste out this code right here just like this and then simply hit the play button and it'll run the code and now you get the document right there. Let me just close this right here just like this and you can see that this is the document that I have right here just like this. And that is how you can go ahead and generate out Word document um, uh, by using Visual Basic code that can be generated using DeepSeek. So I hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.